Good morning, and it is a very early morning. Um, my name is Rebel, and I am the Rebel Reseller. And those of you that are new to my channel, I've been selling on eBay for 22 years. Most of it's been full-time, and this is our primary income. I do also cross-list to Facebook and Bonanza, and I was on Mercari, but I'm not on that right now. So today I'm going to do a haul that I've been looking forward to and just haven't had time. Um, this, these items are from the online auction that I went to, it seems like months ago already. It was. Yeah, it's been months and we've just been blessed with a whole lot of good sourcing and I just haven't had a chance to get to it. But I'm going to make a concerted effort this week to try to get through a bunch of it. But you know how that goes with plans. Um, for those that haven't seen the previous videos, you can probably put a link, right, to some of the originals? Yeah, I can, but will I remember? Yeah. Um, back several months ago, we did an online auction that I found through Facebook, and it was all toys. Well, not toys. It was all advertising type, um, items that were vintage. The, the person who... Um, did this was anything. Um, she had cups and plush, lots and lots of plush, and just other things that, for the most part, were advertising. A lot of it was McDonald's and, you know, fast food and drug companies and stuff like that. And my husband and I sat that evening that the auctions were ending, and I ended up winning. I'm already forgetting numbers. I think I won... 120 some lots. 136. 100, okay, 130s. 130. We'll round off lots. 130. Now, when I say we won these lots, these a lot of them were huge lots that all I could see was one picture of whatever was on the top of the lot. So I had to use a judgment call. But I'm telling you, uh, people weren't bidding on this stuff hardly. Now, there were a few that I lost that I let go because the prices were just going crazy. But for the most part, I paid two and three dollars for these lots. Now I ended up spending five hundred and ninety dollars on the entire lot, and that included um, premium fees and taxes. Um, so far, I have listed about a hundred and sixty items only, and I've sold twenty four items. But I've already made about nine hundred dollars just on those twenty four items. So this has been. Uh, just an amazing lot. So today I want to go through a few more bags. Um, most of it's still sitting over where I keep my listed items. And I'm hoping to get through a couple of bags at a time in these lots. Now, it's been so long, I don't even remember what's in these bags. So it's going to be like Christmas morning for me. This first thing that I'm going to show is a box of McDonald's, mostly, I think, Happy Meal buckets. Um, I think they're all vintage but I don't know. But I just kind of was eyeballing solds just now, and I noticed like this one is selling for like $20. Um, some people have put like three of them together from the same year, and it was like $50 and $60. Um, and I am pretty sure, I think this one I saw an auction that ended for like $15. Um, and then I've seen a few that were like selling for like $25 just for it. And I think this type was only, I want to say seven or eight dollars or something. But I'm telling you, I only paid two or three dollars for this whole box. So um, I'm looking forward to going through these and getting them listed hopefully today. All right, I'm going to start with the first bag of stuff. Now, some of this, um, they had issues because they were stored for a long time. I don't know if I'll be able to save them, but I'm going to just go ahead and pull some out. Um, like I said, this is all advertising. This is Chicken of the Sea, a mermaid. I am not going to be able to address the prices on these because I've never sold this type of stuff before for the most part, but very cute. And based on the other stuff that you, yeah. we've pulled out of here, this might be four dollars or it might be ninety dollars exactly it's it's just been crazy um and i'm so looking forward to getting this stuff listed and you know <laughs> all right this is rca nipper it does need a good bath 
Don't know. Oh, it is Dakin dated 1980. Here's two Hershey bars. I'm going to have to deal with that. It did have its tag, but because it's going to need a bath, that'll go. But I'm hoping I can save these, and I'll probably do lots. There were lots of candy. I bought a bunch of M&Ms. I mean, whole bags of m and stuff, because nobody was buying them. Here's another Hershey's. This must be a Hershey's lot or something. Another little Hershey's bear with its tag. Kissables. Oh, how cute. This is another Hershey bear. It is... Don't know. Don't know. But how cute is that? It feels... Like there might... Oh... There was something inside of it, I, oh, I think, at some point. I'm not quite sure. I'll have to check into that. This is Tyson Chicken. All right, this is Stanley the Moose from Tanger Outlets. Um, we have one of them in Pigeon Forge, so this may be where it came from. Don't know if he's got a hat somewhere, but he says, Virginia... Diner. Not quite sure. Obviously very vintage, but got this cute little denim pants on. Here's the little girl. This is this is a little Debbie doll. Look, she's got her shoes and little socks. No idea, but how cute is that? Uh-oh. Tie. Uh-oh. More tie. I list these. I sell these usually for a couple of dollars, four or five dollars on a lot of times on Facebook. There's still collectors out there. Another Hershey Kiss. I've got a couple more of these. I may make a lot of the ones that are shaped like the Kiss. But how cute is that? That's a Statue of Liberty. This is the Keebler Elf. This is by Animal Fair. I've talked about that brand before. I love it. Very vintage. Um, I'm not seeing a date. You sure but... that's not uh, Lucky? Oh. <laughs> one of us is right and one of us is wrong. General Mills sounds like cereal usually, to me. Usually it's me if he has to point it out. Um, but he's felt... And in excellent condition. Look at him. Oh, okay. Let's keep on keeping on. I think this is a oh, Y2K donor. I guess maybe a blood bank. March of Dimes Bear. Still in his bag. Oh, Warhead, Wally Dudes. I used to teach, and I would uh, bring candy in for my students as incentives, and they loved the Warheads. Just kind of a side story there. His name is Soccer Wally. Cute. Oh, cute. It says Wise Fly, Beanbag Friends. Excluding, oh, this must have came from a pharmacy because there's a coupon that excludes prescriptions. Oscar Meyer says just whistle. Couple of bears. Let's see. Is this that? Yeah, this is the Ali Salvino's Bammers. I have no clue who this is. Maybe Robert will be able to say. It says Allie. Oh, that's that Bambino's. Ollie. Ollie. This is Mr. Mint. Alan Rosen. It says Mr. Mint. The million dollar dealer. So somebody. Mr. Octobears. Oh, isn't this one of those? Bears, that's prescription drugs. I don't remember. It says lumpy. Count Chuck 
Dracula. I think there's a whole series of these. Maybe I'll find them all and be able to put them together. And then this is an A&W bear. I already had a lot, but I already sold um, two little bears that were A&W for $10. So I'm hoping maybe there'll be some more in here and I can do small lots with them. Ouch. It's a little white bear plush, but it's Q-tips. But he's still sealed in his bag, so... He feels very soft like a Q-tip. Oh, this is Grand Furniture. This is that purple one that I thought was a drug company. This is Grand Furniture, which is, I'm not, we have one in our area, but I'm not sure if it's a nationwide thing. This is Bath and Body Works. Little cat knit plush. Here's another um, grand home furnishing. It definitely needs a bath, but if I get him cleaned up, I'll probably put him with the other, the purple one that's not um, in a bag. I think I've had this before. Um, oh, it's craft singles, a care, a, a cow, but it's in its bag. Oh, another Hershey's. Again, it also needs cleaned. Oh, it's got a posable leg. It's by Petting Zoo. It's got some wear though, but I may end up putting all three of them together in one lot. Shoney's Bear in the bag. I think I, I haven't even got to all of them. I have listed some of them. There was a whole lot of them. It was in the last bag. Yeah, in the last time that we listed. Ooh. Oh, I don't know what this is. Big old Montgomery Ward. Montgomery Ward Company picture. Does have some wear. No idea though. Oh, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to salvage him. He's the uh Spuds McKenzie Buds. Bud Bear, be, Bud Plush Dog. But look, he's got some issues. Maybe I'll try to bleach him, but then it'll probably damage the shirt. I'm going to take him out of his bag. Well, no, I'm going to leave him because he's got advertising. But this is Teddy Graham's Bear with his little tag. But he's got some advertising stuff, so I'll probably leave it all together. I had another bear like this. It, I think it was Isamil Milk. It was red. I've already sold it. Um, yeah, this is Isamil too. So I'm ho I think I got like $15 for it. So that'll be nice. Snuggle Bear. I always find these. They're probably eight to twelve dollars. Yeah. Aww. This is from Douglas Company, but it's the Campbell Soup. His tag here says Chunky Soup. Oh, he's got some discoloration on his back, so I will probably have to give him a bath and hopefully he'll be a treasure for me. This is a large Dairy Queen ice cream cone that's still in his bag, sealed. How cute. I need to quit saying that. I said that too much. Oh, this is a th I think this is Quest for Camelot. Still in its bag. It says, oh, Smucker's Jelly. Here's another A&W, but I think it's the same as the one I had, but this one's in the bag. This is Sally Slice. I've had this before. I think I already have one. It may even be listed already, but Sally Slice. It's some kind of bread. Flowers Bakery. All right, another Snuggle Bear with his tag. Oh. 
sure feel leader of the packables. This is Harley Davidson. I think I have another plush that's Harley Davidson kind of like this. I'm not quite sure what's going on. It just kind of seems like it's got some off colors. Another Warhead plush, so I'll definitely put those two together unless they're just some crazy price by themselves. Jelly Belly. This is Toy Story, but it says SpaghettiOs on top. Not quite sure what it is. Oh, a, like soup a soup container. That's what it looks like. Yeah, how nice. I don't know what this is, but cheetah or leopard. Got a baby on it. I'm trying to read it. Some kind of drink cup top. And then Blue's Clues. Love Blue's Clues. Kroger has its own little baseball here. Some kind of pee. Is that a sports team? Here. No, because it's like a manta ray or something. I'm not I'm sure, sure you'll do it. Cheerios. I might have something similar to this. So I'll make a lot. And this is another Isomil bear. So if... I'll probably keep these all separate since the other one sold so quickly. And this is American Red Cross Bear. All right, starting the last bag of stuff. This is a goldfish bunny. This is Jeffrey from Toys R Us. Very tall. He's got wiry legs. He's going to probably end up in a two shoe boxes put together for shipping. I may already have one of these. This is a Craftsman Bear plush. He's got this cute little denim outfit on. I think we have nose issues. I don't think he's going to be usable. Just like the people in our house are Waking coming back up. to life. Yeah, that's how early it is. We've just got people getting up. This is, it says Millennium Countdown Bear. Paul, oh, look, it had a little clock. I wonder if that comes out. And then this is, I want to say Mayfield Milk. Yeah, this is Elsie, I believe. Is it Mayfield or Borden? Warden. We were all counting down to the end of the world back then yes. with this millennium clock. These are the Kellogg's. No. Kellogg's came out with the little miniature version of these. This is Tycho from 1997. I think I have maybe the whole set. There is tons here. And some of these are super rare. And I'm, I'm not even going to try to quote, but like this, I've never seen this one, and I sell these quite often. And they, this is Natasha. And then, what was her name? This is Betty, I believe. I've not seen some of these. And then The Count and Mumford. Rosita and Guy Smiley. Now, I'm thinking, if I've got the complete set, I may list these all together. The honkers do really well. I think there's a couple of them here. There's a couple different colors. Um, and I'm thinking it may be a couple hundred dollars if I put them all together. Just because how many times can you get the entire set with their tags? This is a Twiddlebug, Oscar, Ernie, Bert, Sherlock Hemlock. Harry Monster, 
Of course, Mr. Snuffle Up, I guess. I thought, oh, Zoe, I forgot her name. Barkley, Big Bird, Elmo, Rubber Ducky, Grover, I forget his name. Oh, Benny Rabbit. And there may be a few more hidden. Oh, yeah, here's Cookie Monster. I swear that might be all of them. That's very exciting. This is a different Cookie Monster. He's a Paws. This is another one of the Flowers Bakeries. His name is Bucky Bunny. More advertising. Best Buy Biz. Obviously, Woody Woodpecker. Says, but it's a NASCAR plush. Harley Davidson. But again, they have these kind of fake leather type hats. And they're not doing well with age. Beanbag Friends. Not quite sure who is advertising for. Pink Panther with his tag. Tussie 12 in his bag. Some type of, I know that's like cough syrup. Aw. These aren't, aren't doing well with age either. This age, this is McDonald's Hamburglar. And then, of course, I think he's the Burger King dude. Quite sure what we go what got going on here. It's a nose, it looks like to me. Atrovent, yeah. Drug company stuff. Another um, cheese slice cow. If I find the whole set of these, that would be nice. That's the snap crackle pop dudes. Another Blue's Clues in his bag. Another drug company, Major Relief Nasal Spray. Mattress Warehouse. I think several Zithromax. So I may put them together. I think I have another one somewhere also. This is the pizza dude. Who is it? Caesars? Oh, Caesars. Yeah, Caesars Pizza Pizza. Tony. Toucan Sam. This is a white Garfield. It says 100% Angel. I've watched Garfield. That's a lie. What? Oh, yeah. He's not an angel. Here's a dig them from the cereal. Oh, there's so much little here. Axid needs a bath. A lot of drug stuff in here. Another drug company. Another dress, Astolin. I've done so well with that stuff. So I'm hoping. The Rooster Dude. I guess that's Kellogg's, right? Pampers. Needs a bath. I've got two other ones listed right now, so if I get him cleaned up, I'll probably make a lot of three and put them together. InfoSurf. I've got one of these that's not in the bag. Some more of these, uh, what are they? Protonics. I've got coffee mugs and other plush just like this. So I may increase the lot and add these if they're different. This is all drug stuff. Oh no, now I say that. This is a gooned WWF plush. Bush's Beans. That's a... That's local. That's local. So that's, that's kind of cute. All that beautiful bean footage. 
Yep. Some more Hershey Kisses. Snickers. I'll have to cut that out if we'll get some sort of trademark yeah. thing. <laughs> Copyright or something. Oh, a second one of the Kisses. Oh, kisses. Rice Krispies, dude. So that's two. Maybe I'll find the last one. More Hershey's. Oh, baby bear goes with the beans. Here's another nose, dude. Allegra. John 316. Oh, it's a mini bear. Another Spuds McKenzie. He too. He's got his tag. That's kind of nice. Still going. American Cancer Society. I may make a lot with the Red, lot, red, uh, red Cross one. Uncrustables. Lots of cool stuff. Fisher's Bologna. That's, that's a local thing. I don't know. We used to sell that on Amazon. Remember we'd buy the big, the pickle, big yes. pickle bologna jars and they sold yeah. like crazy? Yeah. I tried one. Just could not do it. It yeah, was no. not good. Dakin. It's Garfield, but he's advertising Girl Scout cookies. Yeah. And then Radio Flyer. Oh, look. Radio Flyer. He's got a little wagon on him. I've had this before. Cottonelle. It's a dog with a picture frame. He's in his bag, which is nice. Reese's. And oh, the post office. How cute is that? Oh, wait. Oh, you wow. Get out the Stuart for Christmas. Yeah. If he ever comes back. If he ever comes route. back. He was such a good mailman. Yes. Our mailman has been relocated, hopefully temporarily, because he was amazing. He would send me a text 30 minutes before he arrived here, and then he scanned all my packages in the driveway before he left. And it didn't matter whether I had 10 or 50. This is cute. I don't know if I've had all three of these at the same time. These are Charmin bears, and there's Bill and Amy and Dylan. There may be another one. Another Zithro Max. This is another Bush's Baked Beans. Well, I may be doing a lot for that. The Home Depot. Are you trying to tell me I need to hurry up? Got karate class coming up. So. I know. Shell Oil, but it's a cow. Or a bull. No, it's got a ribbon, so it has to be a cow. All right. Beetle Bailey. I might have the Sarge, but maybe I've sold him already. This is the dog from How, to, How the Grinch Stole Christmas. But he must be a finger puppet or something, because he's got a hole there. But he's a clip-on. MDA, I'm thinking muscular dystrophy, dog. Oh, I've got another one of these, maybe a little bit bigger, so I might make a lot. Quincy's Big Fat Yeast Roll. Ah, oh, here's one of the other, this, oh, Telly Monster. So, it's looking good that I might have them all. This is something about cancer. Oh, American Cancer Society. So I will have a lot of them going. Another Harley Davidson. But again, the it's like flaking. This guy's half plush, and then he's got posable hard feet. But, oh, oh, Washington Apples. Relay for Life, the Energizer Bunny in his pack, 
NASDAQ bull. Oh, very dirty, but this I'm sure I can hopefully get him clean. But he's the magic chef. It's a bank. This is another one of the bears that goes with the American Cancer Society. I think I've shown him already too. Charlie, the Starkist Tuna. Crayola, he's got some issues. I do not know who this is. When you brought the Little Caesars guy up earlier and you were doing the I thought of this guy. That's the Noid from Domino's, from Avoid the Noid, oh. back when they had their, like, all pizzas delivered in under 30 minutes or whatever. Very cute. All right. Last few. Zircom. No idea. Oh, look. Pizza again. Tony's Pizza. Oh, by Animal Fair. This is Arthro Tech. I have another, some more of these, so I may just end up, after I give him a bath, put him with them. This says Boyd's Bear, but he's got a Crayola thing on his bottom foot. So, ooh, and he's kind of a mini, but I don't think he's a mini mini, but we'll see. I have an amazing what sold for you guys coming up. That's Boyd's Bears. But this will probably come out after the what sold. Oh, truth. So I had. You could say I, I had. had an amazing sale. This is um. Oh, actually, look, I got several Flintstones. I've got Barney, Fred, and Dino. They're really hard plastic. This is Cystic Fibrosis Foundation. And then I just got some littles here. Chase Bear. A little InSync Bear. Recruit Donors. Another little blood. I mean, put that in a lot with the other one. Uh, Russell Stover's. Another Hershey's Kiss. Keychain with Sully from Monsters, Inc. Versed Syrup. Little koala bear. He looks like he's a, a grabber. Probably I can see. Yeah. Let's see. All right. Another Energizer Bunny. Do not know if he will work. It looks like he has a battery. Oh, it's a light. A little walker that's a toy. Another March of Dimes needs a bath. Who knows? Here's a bag. Maybe it's a Happy Meal. Yeah, Long John Silver's bag with the Kellogg's Rice Krispie Dudes. I'm telling you, there were all kinds of stuff. There's a little Hershey's bag from Times Square. You just never know. I have a listing right now for the old blue Walmart bags. I ain't sold them yet, but there's others listed. All right. Here's Eckerd Drugs. I don't even know if they're still around. I know the one around here closed. And Pacific Life. That's it. That was the whole bag. I am so looking forward to getting this stuff listed. All right. I hope you enjoyed this. You know, it's a blast from the past. Um, that many of us probably have never seen. Um, thanks for watching. Please, as always, like, subscribe, get your friends to like and subscribe. Click on the bell. All right.